Welcome back to your home for electrical industry news, information and entertainment, electrictv.net, powered by the NECA IBEW team. I'm your host, Dominic Geritano. How do you measure the training of a crafts professional in today's construction industry? I want you to think about that, really and truly. How do you measure training? Can you evaluate training based on looks alone? The NECA IBEW team believes the answer isn't as easy as it seems. They believe it takes five years in over 8,000 hours of on-the-job training and an additional 900 hours of related instruction. And it just so happens, that's exactly how long it takes to complete a union electrical apprenticeship program. An increasing number of suppliers and manufacturers, some of the biggest names in the business, are also beginning to see that this union self-funded training model is not only the way, but the only way. Education and training is big business. It's not something that should be taken lightly and certainly deserves more than the lip service many give it in today's construction industry. Hands down, unequivocally and without question, NECA, the National Electrical Contractors Association, and the IBEW, the International Brotherhood of Electrical Workers, have the most advanced and 21st century training operation in the history of the industry. Their training arm, the NJATC, makes sure of it. We develop the standards and, and create the curriculum that is taught across the nation uh, for all of our apprentices and journeymen that are in the electrical industry. Throughout the 285 local union training centers, no longer are the current 40,000 union apprentices being trained in the same old ways. Traditional, hands-on techniques are now being blended with high-tech, computer-based learning applications, allowing for this new breed of apprentice to become proficient in the basics and masters with in-demand, geo-specific job skills. Now, giving the flexibility of each region to say, we want to move more in an industrial route, we want to move more in a green energy, we want to move more in these various specializations, and the training now can adapt to the needs of the contractors in those regions to provide more flexibility, to allow them to bid on more jobs that are related to what they need to do. There's a desperate need for change in the electrical industry in particular, and we think we can be a catalyst for that. And working with the NJTC is a really solid opportunity to do that. This new approach is called blended learning, and it's made possible through new partnerships with some of the best suppliers and manufacturers in the construction industry, some of which we caught up with at a recent training partner summit in South Carolina to really get together with an organization, a top organization like the NJATC, understand what their moving forward goals are, how they're really um, developing and evolving the way that, that students learn today and incorporating that blended learning approach. And it provides an opportunity for us to get not only a line of sight on what they think is important and where they're headed, but also to talk with other industry leaders about how we can work together to provide an even better experience for the participants who go through the JATC training programs. For the NJATC staff themselves, uh, you know, it's an excellent forum to get real-time feedback about what matters, right? How do we continue, we the NJATC staff, how do we continue to, to um, provide that right organization, the right framework uh, to accomplish what each individual training partner needs and at the same time move the whole industry forward. From our standpoint, it's a comfortable environment. Uh, we get to be very expressive with our opinions. Uh, the team here listens very well and we're excited to participate because we actually get value and not only at a high level, but we get to go back and we take some of those strategic thoughts and actually go back to the field and employ them. I think the other thing about these meetings I've noticed over the years is they are getting better. They're getting more comprehensive with more people involved. Um, you learn from one another. People have new ideas and uh, the communication is great. The latest technologies, products and services are now getting into the hands of today's apprentices before they hit your job site. You're going from more of a book environment with somebody who was maybe trained that way long ago into more of a 3D interactive environment. The NJATC is a, a top tier organization that really provides a well-seasoned, well-rounded, well-educated electrical worker in the industry. It, it's a, a premier organization that really thinks about not only how to install a device, but educating the workforce on why and where and what makes the best, most safe 
um, practical installation for everybody involved, both for the worker and for the end user at, at the end of the installation. It really happens with the electricians in the field. And from our standpoint, you know, when you have an electrician that you would hire from this organization, you know that they've been trained very well, very thoroughly, and very professionally. We think this is a, this is a chance to actually uh, influence how things are done, not just what products use, but, but in fact how things are done in the future in the electrical industry. The question then becomes, who benefits the most? The benefit to the end user of the NJATC program and our partnering with the NJATC to deliver the best education to installers is that they, that they get a safer building, they get a quality installation with, with fewer problems, better reliability, and the best possible efficiency that, that they would want. Ultimately, the customer is why we're in business. We serve the customer. But in this process of these partnerships, you know, everybody benefits and uh, I think that's the best part of it and it's just educating people how that can happen. Anytime that you're working with someone who's providing the equipment and the tools that you work with every day uh, and it gives us an opportunity to enhance our membership's ability to, to do the job, it, it's got to be a win-win. The NECA IBEW team measures training by the millions of self-funded training dollars they invest annually the tens of thousands of new apprentice graduates ready to go to work on your next project and the innumerable happy customers who've seen the value of a union-built job since 1891. We began this video with a question and we'd like to end with one too. Can you name another company in the electrical industry who can measure training better than the NECA IBEW team? We can't either. And as always, remember that as the industry changes, the NECA IBEW team will change with it and continue to not just train, but train well. Want to be kept in the loop when we post content here on Electric TV? It's easy. Subscribe above. Follow us on Twitter for even more news and information. Until next time, I'm Dominic Giratano. So long for now.